Hey guys, um, this is how to um, reduce lag on Gary's Mod or Valve games or whatever Valve game you have, except Portal 2 because that's been updated. Um, so basically, what you want to do is go to Options in any Valve game you have, Left 4 Dead particularly or Gary's Mod, just not Portal 2. Can't help you there. Go to Video. Uh, I wouldn't adjust any of these controls right here unless it's extremely laggy. If it's extremely laggy, like you can't really even see what's happening. Lower the resolution to about 1280 to 7 to 720, uh, depending on the size of your monitor. All right. So beyond that, go to Advanced. Um, now I have a pretty high-end computer, so obviously my settings are high, which would cause a lag on a uh, an older computer. So just acknowledge what's on here right now. But first, what you want to do is go to Model Detail. Now, depending on how laggy it is. If it's not that laggy, um, but you know it's a small lag, you want to you're going to want to put that to medium or low. Uh, if it's really laggy, put it to low. Um, for texture detail, put that at about medium. Yeah, put that at medium. If it's really laggy or just light or just a little laggy, you're still going to want to put that medium. Uh, put shader detail at low. Sh uh, shadow detail at low. And let me just um, say something. If uh, you you may notice a difference in uh, picture performance. I mean, normally you wouldn't notice a huge difference. I mean, it's not like it's going to switch from Crisis graphics to Minecraft graphics. It's it's just going to be like a little less uh, detectable. Like the gauge on your uh, physics gun is going to be a little off. Like you can't really see the speedometer on your Jeep. Well, if if that's okay, then whatever. Disable color correction. Uh, wa water detail, uh, just put at world reflections, or reflect world. Um, Anti-alias, anti, -alist anti -al whatever, put it at none. Uh, filtering mode, trilinear, or uh, anisotropic 8x. Uh, disable vertical sync. Uh, well, multi-core rendering depends on your processor. If you have two gigahertz. I mean, ah, sorry, two cores, disable it. If you have four cores, enable it. But if you don't know, just disable it then. Uh, oh, sorry. Put field of view at 75.0. Uh, Motion blur should be at uh, enabled. This, um, ah, sorry. This, um, when you move your camera, it blurs out um, your viewing, so it doesn't have to generate as many pixels uh, or sh shader detail as you're moving. Uh, d put uh, high dynamic range at none. Um, use bloom if uncheck. Use bloom effect when available if it's already unchecked. Okay. Uh, yeah. So that's.